Oh. And we're rolling. Hey, what's up guys? Jared here. We are back in the shop. I say we because... I'm here. That guy. AJ's here. And he is currently clay bar in the last part of this truck. He's, we've washed it, cleaned it, brought it inside. Then he has went around the whole thing clay barring it. A lot of you might recognize this truck from two weeks ago, but this is not the same truck. This is its twin. And we are doing the exact same thing to this. We're gonna be tinting the front two windows, put an eyebrow on it. Uh, doing some paint correction, some paint, chip paint repair. some paint chip repair. As, as you can see here, I'll bring you in close. I don't know if you can see these paint chips or not, but he's gonna be doing that paint chip repair. And then we're gonna put paint protection over three quarters of the truck. And then after that, we're gonna be ceramic coating the whole thing so we got that so stay tuned for those pictures and videos we have a race car in the shop as you can see this sharp looking car nice body lines nice looking car here is Kind of what the car is going to look like other than we're going to have fluorescent on it. But this is a mini version of this. Hey, so. Can you make more of those? What's that? Can you make more of those? Yeah, we can make little cars. We can make little cars. We can make big cars. Small cars. Skinny cars. Fat cars. Round cars. Tall cars. Any kind of cars you want us to make. Brent is currently getting let me see if i can flip boom there's brent he is our camera guy setting up our 360 our gopro 360. we've done some tint jobs so far this week they're outside a couple brows a couple front windows we have a full week ahead of us of race cars we got extra bodies on the back portion of our shop here i'll show you I just don't want the heavy soap. Here's another race car body. People bring us their tins. We build it on our rat board. Here's my plant. Rockers. Look at this thing. Huh? Look at that. Is that more soap than you would like? Or is that Man, that's a good looking plant. No, that's, I just wanted to use some that's actually my longest living plant that I've ever had. So I'm a little pumped about that. So the garage is full. Our plate's full for the week. The new shop is coming along. We are more than halfway done with that, waiting for people to come back to finish up a few different things. So make sure you stay tuned. Make sure you hit that like button, follow us on Facebook, Instagram, check out our YouTube page because on YouTube is where you're gonna find all the updates for the new shop. Check out our TikTok, a couple funny videos there. And Eric, tell the people to have a good day. Have a good day. truck paint corrected at this point and what we're gonna do now is this particular truck came with paint protection which is just on the lower rocker panel here and what we're gonna do is remove it and we're gonna do the whole box side the whole box of this truck because if you can zoom in here you see how all of this paint chip can you get that good and focused just a lot of marks but this whole side right here if you can see all these marks all of these marks are not in the paint because of the paint protection film. If you can see over here, I have started removing some of the paint protection. Put the light down. And what this paint protection is, it's just a clear uh, eight mil or 10 mil clear uh, film 
that comes on it from the factory. Being an Expel uh, installer, we're gonna remove this, finish paint correcting this bottom portion, and then reapply Expel's paint protection to the whole box side. That way, when he's going down the road, when he's on dirt roads, all of these paint chips it won't happen anymore because the paint protection that Expel offers protects your paint, protects your investment, protects your vehicle from the damages that saw cinders, uh, grocery carts at your local grocery stores when they bump into it will protect your paint job from damage like this. So this is a before shot of it and stay tuned. I'm gonna be steaming this off and removing it and then we'll show you an after so you can see the the distinctiveness between paint without paint protection and paint with paint protection and the result of how much it does protect. So hang with us, it is gonna take a little while to remove this, so enjoy the video. So now that I got all the paint protection off, you can see the distinct line. And this is the difference between having paint protection on your vehicle or not having paint protection on your vehicle. So now that we have the paint protection off, we're gonna go ahead and chip correct this and then paint correct this, that we, we get rid of all these paint chips. And then we're gonna go ahead and protect the whole box of this truck with paint protection. You can see where the paint protection stopped back here. There's a distinct line right there. Hopefully the light's good enough to where you guys can see it. And this is just, having paint protection on your vehicle is just gonna save you in the long run. Whether you wanna trade your vehicle in or you might wanna try to repaint your vehicle. When you, when you add paint protection to your vehicle, it's, it's more of an investment than anything. You're protecting your vehicle's paint to where once, you're, once you wanna trade it in or once you wanna get rid of the vehicle, whatever, all you have to do is pull this paint protection off and your vehicle is still in a brand new condition. So now that we have that done, we're gonna go ahead and get to work correcting all these paint chips and then putting paint protection on the whole box of this. That way the customer doesn't have all of these flaws in their vehicle. Because who wants to damage their vehicle that they use for work? So if you guys want, if you're interested in learning more about paint protection, uh, if you're interested in protecting your investment, make sure you check out our Facebook page, hit us up on Instagram, follow us on YouTube, uh, get in contact with us through our website and we'll show you the cost and the different ways that you can protect your vehicle from damage like this. Eric isn't uh, thrilled to be here today. I'm the, always thrilled to be the here. The warm weather is coming and he wants to get his bike out and go for a ride. So on these nice sunny days that we have, it's really hard to, to keep him here, so. They don't even know what you, I'm gonna go show you what Eric's bike looks like. I'd tell you her name, but it's, it's a secret right now. Oh, what a day. So, Eric bought a Harley last year and he has torn the engine apart. He does a lot of the work himself because he's super mechanical. And it used to be all black with the chrome engine. He tore that apart and he has gotten a lot of the engine powder coated black. He's putting a lot of red to it. He used to ride dirt bikes, so he has kind of dirt bike looking pegs on it and he has put a lot of paint protection on. So I'm gonna turn you guys around. I hope you're ready. Look at this thing. So this is why it's hard to keep Eric focused and Eric busy. Cause he just wants to be out on this hog all day. And it's coming, he's gonna be on it. We're gonna take a trip. We're gonna do what they call like the bun burner or whatever they call that, where you gotta ride 1500 miles in 36 hours. 
We're gonna be doing that here once the weather warms up. So he has got this thing looking sharp. So if you see him out on the road, make sure you honk at him, beep at him, get his attention. Make sure you pull him over so you can check that bike out. He's done some engine work. So make sure you say hi to him. Thanks for checking in. Thanks for stopping. And we will see you on the flip side. Now that we've got the paint protection off, we've cleaned it. Eric's went through and uh, did a chip correction on it. So if your vehicle does have chips, we can get rid of the majority of them. Uh, so if you're interested in that, make sure you contact us. But since everything is now cleaned up, uh, we are gonna go, eat, go through and clay bar everything and then paint protect. We're gonna put paint protection on the whole box now. That way, as he's traveling down the road, any stones or chips or anything that hits the box of this truck hey, will be protected. Hey, thank you. And no damage will be done to the paint job. Same thing with the rockers. We're gonna come through and we're gonna put paint protection on the whole rockers and the fender flares on the truck. So this truck, when it leaves here, is going to be uh, protected from all the chips and all the crap that's on our roads. So if your vehicle has a lot of chips, a lot of scratches, swirls, stuff like that, Make sure you contact us. We can hook you up with uh, some paint correction, some paint protection, fix your chips, get you back to looking good. Hit us up at Moose Wraps on the Insta, Facebook, YouTube, our website, however you got to. Bam! Bam.